Oh dear. What's wrong, Mussy? You seem worried about something. It's nothing about any of you, or me for that matter. I just heard something from the director, and I'm not sure if we should address it. Well, what is it? Maybe we could help. Well, honestly, it concerns something I was trusted to keep secret. I haven't even been able to tell any of you. Really? Not even Spitty? Wait, why me specifically? I mean, you've been her friend longer than the rest of us. Fair enough. No, not even Spitty. I'm sorry. It's not anything that really should be of concern. It just has to do with Buffy. Buffy, what's wrong? Is she okay? Oh, she's fine. She's fine. She just- I heard my name. Anyone see any commies? Buffy- Hmm? What's with the long face, Mussy? Did they finish that credit union? No. It's not that. I just heard from the director. Yeah? The visitors. They know. No? Know what? Buffy. Uh, did you tell anyone? No, of course not. I would never betray your trust like that. They figured it out on their own. If you want us to leave the room... Yes, I don't mind. Whatever makes you comfortable. No, no. I guess it's time to tell the truth. The fact is, ladies, I'm a fraud. Fraud? What does that mean? You shouldn't be so mean to yourself. It's true. This isn't my real face. What do you mean by that? I shouldn't be surprised someone figured it out. Didn't it ever bother you all that I talked about how I flew over Finland and yet I have Dutch markings? I admit I did notice, but I figured it was none of my concern. I appreciate your politeness, Spitty. Well, this form is borrowed. It belongs to a replica of one of my sisters. She was nice enough to let me use her image so I could hide myself. Why would you want to do that, though? I'm... I'm hideous. Absurd! You're Finland Sky Pearl! You said so! Maybe once, a long time ago. But that time has passed. Buffy, I know it is hard, but you don't need to hide from any of us. I agree. Indeed. We're all friends here. You can trust us. You say that now, but you haven't seen what's left of me. Are you sure? Absolutely. You don't have to hide anymore. Don't say I didn't warn you. Here. This is the real me. Oh, Buffy. Goodness. What? What happened to you? I wasn't lying about my past. Just my face. I flew with a pilot named Lori Picuri. He was kind to me, and he was an excellent flyer. We engaged a group of hurricanes in 1942. Hurricanes? You mean... Yes. I'm sorry, Spitty. Your country had given some to the Soviets, and we were on opposite sides. It's all right. I guess it should be expected. Lord knows I hang around former enemies these days, so I can't be angry. I think we've all moved past it. I managed to shoot down two of the hurricanes, but a third got the better of me. Lori was forced to put me down on a lake. He escaped back to safety, but he had to leave me behind. I sank to the bottom and remained there alone for 56 years. 56 years? That's so horrible! I was finally salvaged and smuggled out of Russia in 1998, but I wasn't saved exactly. They had to ship me in pieces, and I changed hands so many times I lost count. Eventually, I wound up at a museum, but a hurricane, funnily enough, struck the building, and plans to restore me were cancelled. God certainly got a dark sense of humor. I was then sent on loan to another museum, and though I'm on display as you can see, I have never been restored. Even putting me back together was difficult, as many of my parts were stolen during the multiple times I was shipped. And Mussy, you knew this whole time? Buffy confided in me years ago. You're a good friend, Mussy. Thank you for keeping my secret. But why hide? There are plenty of our family members that are in rough shape. You don't need to be ashamed, Buffy. It's easy for you to say. You all have strong followings. People that love you. Me? Do you have any idea how many people point and laugh at the terrible and ill-fated Brewster Buffalo? How I was a complete failure. A disaster. A loser. Last time I showed my real face, someone said I deserve to look like this. Well, that's a load of trash. Zero? You are not the product of a failure, Buffy. You are not to blame for the progression of time. Yeah, my sisters and I outclassed you. But you were not a bad plane. By that logic, all of us are terrible because Mussy exists. I mean, I could probably take Mussy. Could you? Never mind. Buffy, you were cast out by your own nation. You wound up on the opposite side in a war, yet you still fought. You fought so hard that your adoptive home loved and adored you. Even after you were lost, you kept fighting long enough to be saved. And yeah, you're battle-scarred. But that's the proudest badge of honor a soldier can have. She's right. Hear, hear. Louder for the people in the back. Thank you, Zero. It means a lot to hear you say that. So, what do you think? You ready not to hide anymore? I only promised to try. That's all we ask, Sky Pearl. It feels good to be able to be honest again. If anyone is mean to you, just come to us and we'll set them straight. We're all allies here, Buffy. Thank you. All of you. 
so seriously, I think I could take Mussy. You absolutely cannot. 